Hi, beautiful. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for being here. Your presence is always something I look forward to. And having you here watching me is what brings happiness to my life. So thank you for that. We're gonna be watching some people give themselves very impulsive haircuts. We have a girl that's going to chop all of her luxurious hair off. We have a girl that is using uh, clippers. She's cutting her hair into a bob with clippers. And then we have another girl that's going to shave her head. Let's hope none of them regret their decisions and let's hope some of these transformations are good. Or let's hope they're just entertaining. That's all I'm really asking for today, you know? I don't really have much to say today. Let's just watch the videos. Let's get into it. And our first video is by Anna Ivanov. And this is called, I chop my hair off because I was bored. Oh, gee. <laughs> oh my God. Sounds like she made a mistake. I don't know. Let's see what happens. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel so thank you i haven't ever been here before but for about a week thank you and i am making the impulsive decision to cut my hair so okay i've done lots of research on how to do this i don't know how short i'm going to do it because i have extremely thick hair let me just say right off the bat holy, holy sh her hair is beautiful. It is luxurious. It is so long. But wow, that is some good quality hair, girl. Give me that shit. I'm gonna make some hair extensions out of it. Send it over here. I hope you donate your hair. And I hope she does cut it really short. Like, ooh, how what would that be? My hair is extremely long. And yeah. It just is like so much of a hassle at this point. Yeah, like, cut that off. The love-hate relationship because sometimes it looks good when I do stuff with it. Uh-huh. I do stuff with it like maybe once a month. So the other days, it's just this. It's like pretty, but it's like a little much. It's doing nothing for her. It looks like she has a blanket on her head, a brown blanket covering that beautiful face. And I don't like that. I think I'm gonna section my hair into four because my hair is so thin. Thick. I would have done uh, like six sections if I were her because that is Woo! <laughs> thick. Um, like I said before, and she's not gonna follow my tutorial. Why aren't you following my tutorial? I have also watched so many of Brad's videos to like see what he says about it. I have an oval face and he said any hair works on that. So it didn't really help me with my decision of the length I should do. I'm sorry. Thanks. <laughs> I'm sorry. Sorry, Anna. I think I actually did recommend something for oval faces. I said anything looks good, but I also said that I like shorter hair or some like that. Let's replay the tape. You can really do anything because you already have the most optimal face shape for a female. Why not have fun with it and go more edgy style? Maybe add a tiny bit of angularity to your face with your haircut while doing a blunt, shorter haircut. That's what I said. Okay, Anna, back off. Okay, we're gonna put a ponytail. I don't have a lot of hope for this. I saw them say that you should put like a safety guard. So like, I'm not gonna cut above this just yet. <gasps> oh my word. Ah, uh, ooh. I hated that she just put the hair tie in and then pulled the hair to make it go up. You're gonna make the hair is like all out of place when you do that, which is gonna make your hair like all uneven and shit. Put the elastic in place and leave it there. Don't pull the ends and make the elastic go up. I'm glad that she um didn't elevate the section. She just brought it down here and put the elastic in and she wasn't like over here and then dropped it down. This could be okay. Probably not, but eh, maybe. Oh, we're pulling the back section forward. Okay. I felt like that was better than doing it wet and looking like a rat. I'm glad that she straightened her hair before doing this. I recommend people at home, if you're cutting your own hair, do it on straight dry hair. Don't do it on wet hair. Or if you have curly hair, cut it curly in its natural state. Now we're doing the cutting. Now we're doing, now we're going for the cut. <sighs> oh my little baby hairs, we're gonna ignore. <laughs> I'm so pale on this shirt. I don't know why I wore it. Oh no. Oh, oh no. Oh yes. Do it. Do it, 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 do it. Oh yeah, this is giving me everything I needed today. Why is it not cutting? Yes. You go, girl. You go, girl. Look at this nub. I love a good okay. nub. Well, I guess I just have to keep going. No, just leave it there. It'll be fine. I hope this turns out good. I hope this turns out good. I hope this is a good idea for her. Oh crap. But I don't know. I, I literally I'm just worse the second time. Oh, that's what I was scared of. I'm just a little nervous for when she actually takes the elastics out, what it's going to look like. I really don't have a lot of hope. 
for this. I never thought this day would come. I know. Nor did I think I was actually gonna do this. Are you kidding me right now, bro? The last section. Fingers what crossed, it's thing? good. Oh my God. That is so much hair. On my head. I'm like really scared. This is the shortest I've ever done it. Crap. Okay. That actually doesn't look bad. <laughs> Wait, stop. <laughs> that one looks bad. That one looks bad. <laughs> okay. No, this looks really good though. There's no going back. <gasps> oh. You missed the mark a little bit, but I'll I'll give it to you. Let's oh, see what she does to fix it. It looks so much better. Oh my god, I'm so happy for her. <gasps> I strongly dislike it. Okay, time to see the back. Wait. Oh no, that's bad. Oh. Could be worse. It could have been worse. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Why do I still have a long piece? How did this guy miss the cut? Excuse me, sir. That's illegal. Okay. <laughs> so this is obviously longer. I'm gonna start saying that to people. Oh. That's illegal. This is when the combs come in handy. Oh, combs are great for hair cutting, yeah. It doesn't look like you're using a comb though. Why is this side so much shorter? Are you kidding? I can't even do half a path down anymore. She needs layers so bad. That thick hair needs movement, girl, or else it's just gonna be like a big mound of hair on your head. Like it needs some short layering. Like let's get into it, girl. Come on, let's do it. I feel like this is good, but Brad would be watching this and be like, uh, no, it's not. The ends can be like fixed up. I'm not saying it's bad actually. So thank you very much. Uh, I am watching it and I'm not saying it's bad. So I think this is all for the video. Oh my word. Uh, it's so short. I really like it now. It's gonna be so much different, obviously. Hope you guys enjoyed me having a mental breakdown and cutting my hair. I did, thank you. You guys enjoyed. Okay, Anna, listen, that could have gone so much worse. I am happy for you. You look great. You changed up your style and you made a big decision to cut your hair. And now it's gonna take like six years to grow that back. Your hair looks amazing. You should keep it short 100%. I think you should go even shorter maybe right here. Layer that shit up. Oh my God, you're beautiful. You look amazing and I am beyond happy for you. Pretty decent job. I give you like a six out of 10 on that one. I mean, that's pretty generous, come on. All right, let's move on to the next video. Our next video is by Miss Stella Cini. We've seen you before, Stella. Let's see if this hair transformation is as good as the last one. It's gonna be pretty hard to top it. This is called cut Cutting my hair off with clippers. No, that's scary. <laughs> Are you sure you want to do that, Miss Stella? Hello, and welcome to hopefully a very exciting video. I f hope so. I was growing through my old pictures, and I was just trying to get some inspiration on what to do next in my hair career. And I went back to this time last year. I got my hair cut to like pretty much chin length. Oh my god, what? That was so pretty. That's one of my favorite haircuts is the chin length bob on a younger person. Like, uh, it's so pretty. I hope she does that exact same thing. I mean, wow, that was hot, yeah. Today, I'm going to be cutting my hair super short and blunt and straight on myself, by myself, using hair clippers. Um, I don't think this is a good idea. Ah, uh, I don't. I don't think it's a good idea either. I'm excited to see if I can do it personally, and I also think it's gonna make a super fun YouTube video. Cutting a one length bob, it is very, very hard to do, even for some hairdressers. I mean, it's very much a precision haircut. You need a lot of skill to do it correctly and well. And girl, I don't know if clippers are gonna do the trick. You're not gonna put any layering in, there's not gonna be any kind of beveling in the end. I don't know about this. I can say one thing though, her hair color, holy is so pretty right now. I'm obsessed. <laughs> like what? Anyways, kind of to there. I'm saying that knowing damn well that I probably won't really have too much control on where the, the bob is going to end up. Uh-huh. Let's do it, because I'm, I'm going to back out of the race. Okay, so here's the- Her hair is so pretty. You're going to see it at the back, look. She does so much to her hair and it's still oh, so gorgeous. Kind of shapeless. Why is your ombre flawless? Sorry, I just want to appreciate her ombre real quick. That is Flawless. I want to cut it. She has yeah, beautiful I'm thick hair. Flawless. Hair clippers because they're cordless. Thick hair is also much harder to cut into a bob because there's so many pieces of hair to work with and there's so much room for error. Today I'm actually going to make it harder on myself. I'm not actually Great. using a mirror over here. Key to making this a haircut even plausible is having like a dual mirror, mm -hmm. mirror system so you could see what's going on. Mm -hmm. But currently I have a monitor 
And that's all that I'm going to be seeing. I don't actually have a mirror. Great, great video. <laughs> great. You will need hair clippers, crocodile clippies. These are my favorite clippies because they bend. Let's start slowly. This is actually quite a bit longer than I want it, but anyways, okay, it cuts. So as I said, I'm going to be start by sectioning off my hair and I'm going to essentially work from the back to the front. I'm glad that she has a plan in mind. That's always great when you're doing something like this. Um, I know a lot of these girls who are doing um, some impulsive haircuts, they don't quite plan anything. Stella though, my girl, she seems like she has a plan and I like that. Oh, it's not even straight, oh my God. <laughs> Good, she's making it perfectly straight before she does this. That's gonna really help make this a precise haircut. <gasps> Woo! <laughs> that looks like so much fun. I'm so jealous. From this side. Ah! <laughs> hmm, I'm so talented. Oh my God, what if it's oh. horrible? What if it does, everything will get well. She also has to be careful while she's doing this with putting her head forward while cutting because what's gonna happen is when she puts her hair back, she's gonna get like a layer of longer hair over the shorter hair because her head was over directed forward. Yeah, that's probably gonna happen inevitably with this. So this has become my guideline. Yay, let's hope I can see it. Okay, so she mentioned that she now has a guideline, which I really appreciate. That's really important that you follow your guide with a haircut. That's the first piece you snip off. You're gonna follow that piece around the head to make sure everything stays the same length. Great job, Stella, but this looks a little rough. One side looks a little longer than the other side. And also, it looks like a shark took bites out of your hair and left it. It's a little rough. I might actually cut the back. That's actually not bad. Let's see if she can like kind of make it work at the end because this is actually shaping up to be kind of decent. Touch it anymore because I want to ruin it. It already looks cute Yay. though. Your hair, yes. Oh, why is she holding it like that? This is actually really cool to watch somebody that's not a hairdresser try this at home. It actually seems decently easier than using scissors. I'm really impressed with her back turning mirror skills. Doing it in the mirror is not easy because everything's backwards and she's really killing it. I cannot do that to the back of my hair. That is some major skill, Stella, major skill. This actually looks kind of good. What? Am I living in an alternate universe right now? How is she doing this? Wait. I was not expecting it to go this well. I knew she was talented at hair, but this is pretty good. Like a bit heavier at the back, which means that the entire haircut is kind of like leaning back and I want it to be more like that. Which means we're gonna have to readjust it all. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, and she's not sectioning anything. Okay, so she's going back in and trying to make it have like an A-line moment where that goes from shorter to longer in the front. God, she needs layering in here really bad now. Cut the top, cut the top, cut the top. Oh, there it goes. Cut that hair off, cut that hair off. Oh my God, with this color too, it looks so good. The last few snippers and we're almost there. We're almost at the finish line. Yeah, I'm anxious to see the end. What is going on? Oh no, what is that? No, we keep going up and up and up. What was the point of sectioning all that hair out if you're just gonna end up chopping all the hair together? What's going on here? Oh my God, okay, put the clippers down. Put them down, though it does look really good. Okay, stop, <laughs> stop cutting. This is where all hairdressers go, it goes bad, is when they just keep cutting and then all of a sudden all the hair is just like gone and it's like f***ed up. Holy hell, I ran out of battery and I am... Thank God. Think done. I don't think I really am like realizing what this is. I'm like, I'm like surprisingly calm for the fact that I cut the most <gasps> To be fair, I... It looks I love it. Oh, oh my, God. my God. Stella, I love it too. So cute. Well, I think it turned out so cute. No, 100% that if I were to like really analyze it mirror to mirror, if I get someone to tell me. <laughs> Sorry, hold on. Because I cut it. I cut it myself. This thing is really hard to control in the mirror on the back of your head. Sometimes you angle it up or down and it's like, weird so i know it's not straight and i know that i'm probably going to be noticing it this looks so bad yeah. <laughs> oh, no. 
throw it away. It's got no- Get rid of those dead ends, girl. Okay, Stella, f everybody. You should be giving yourself way more credit right now because that was really fun to watch. You did an amazing job. The cut came out phenomenal. That was probably the best at-home haircut I've ever seen somebody give themselves. That was so good. I think it's pretty f flawless. I love the shorter hair on you. I do think you should go shorter though. Chin length, please. Thank you. All right. Thank you, Stella. That was incredible. Just like the last video. You actually did top your last video I reacted to. Congratulations. <laughs> Our next video is by Alyssa Gray, and this is called Shaved My Head Because I Got Tired of Washing My Hair After Each COVID-19 ICU Shift. Oh, she's a nurse. Thank you for doing what you do. We all very much appreciate it. I know what you're thinking. She's being impulsive again. Yes, I am. Yeah. Yes, you are. I know that I'm impulsive because I just recently quit my job of three years and then came over to New York to help out with coronavirus. So why not do something else impulsive? Today I am... Another clipper. I'm scared. So shave my head. I am just like so sick of having to cover my head. It's so sweaty, it gets itchy, and every day when I come home, I have to wash my hair. So why not shave it? At the hotel, I have to wash my hair. Like I'm running out of hair products. It's annoying. So I just like had a thought that why don't I just shave my head? I just got my hair bleached in, um, I mean, it's super yellow now because I haven't been taking care of it. Oh my God, it's so long. I really just um, kind of want to get rid of it and just, I'm sick of going to bed with it wet. She's so annoyed with her hair that she's like, F this. I don't need this trash on my head. Get rid of it. We're done. Thank you. Goodbye. That's the kind of attitude I want in life. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing it. I'm excited. This is gonna be so dope. I'm excited too, but nervous. A little nervous. I'm gonna do like small cuts because I don't know how much these scissors are. What are those? Like, these aren't like actual like... <laughs> what are those? Kid scissors? Oh my god, she's really going for it. With no fear. I'm just honestly like excited for my hair to go back to brown and I feel like why not start fresh? <laughs> she's not even phased. She's not even talking yeah, about the fact she just took kind of chic, six inches off her hair. That is really chic. Oh, I'm excited for my hair to grow back brown and be this length. Me too. This is the most chill girl I've ever seen when shaving their head. She does not give a at all. I'm not like end my life impulsive, like, you know, mess up my life. Like I definitely like do well in life, I think. When I have something I want to do, I go and do it. Yes, you are sure such a badass family watch my youtube videos so don't think i'm crazy guys i hate 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 the fact that if girls cut their hair impulsively shave their heads they're considered crazy what is that why can't a girl shave her head why does that make them insane or crazy stop with that note to self next time i shave my head get better scissors i mean i don't know if i'll ever do this again but or just go in with the clippers and just shave it all i don't know why we're cutting it <laughs> Start fresh. That's right. Oh, this is kind of a chic look too, look. Uh, a little oh, asymmetrical oh, bob? Okay. Half short okay. and half long. While I'm here, I might as well just see what I would look like with bangs. <laughs> yes. I always think it's such a lost opportunity for girls not to do like different kinds of haircuts before they shave their head to see what things look good on them and like just try things out. If you're gonna shave it anyways, might as well just try everything, right? Anybody that says that New York has no PPE, I mean, they used to not have PPE, but right now we have a ton of PPE. <gasps> oh That's God. not how you cut bangs, girl. It. That ain't it. People are gonna think that I lost my sh and I don't really care. That's okay. right. Yo, your hair looks f***ing crazy right now. Still gone. But work. I like this short cut though. Yeah, like, like if it was styled. Phase where it's gonna be like growing out and like all fluffy like a newborn puppy. Look at this. It's really hard to grow up short hair. Really, really difficult. It kind of like pokes out. If your hair's straight, it's kind of just like there. Doesn't want to do anything. Like it's a lot to do and it takes a really long time, but you'll be fine. I forgot which way to go. I all this. Go against the grain with, with this. I'm trying to get it in the sink. First pass done. I'm doing this in my hotel room. <laughs> keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Oh my god she already looks good she already looks beautiful this is definitely her look i'm glad she went really short too i hate when people like don't go as short enough and it kind of just looks like a grown-out haircut get it get it get it get it shave it shave it shave it oh my god what a transformation and a thorough job i must say like whew, top notch babe she's a natural at cutting hair there's hair everywhere I think I got it all. Yeah, I think so. Woo! You really did that. I feel like a new woman. Oh my God, she <laughs> looks so bad. 
This is great. That is your look. Honestly, just keep it like that forever. You look amazing. So cool. Great job. Oh my God. Those were definitely impulsive haircuts. <laughs> All of them came out amazingly. How were they all like really, really, really well done and really dramatic? What a great day. Beautiful job, guys. So fun to watch. Thank you for making those videos. I hope you guys enjoyed watching them. Thanks for watching them with me. And make sure you guys follow me on TikTok, Instagram, and Twitter at BradMondoNYC. I also have a Snapchat show and a Facebook page under Brad Mondo. And I also have my beautiful, fabulous hair care line, X Mondo Hair, at X Mondo Hair on Instagram, where you can see all of our new products, all of our existing products and all the hair care knowledge you need to get beautiful, fabulous, glowing, amazing hair. That is all for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to live your extra life and I'll see you next time. Bye guys. This is Electric Cream, our moisture cream. This is a great product to help rebuild and restore your hair. We've combined products like argan oil and wheat extract which is gonna be great for those of you who are looking for restoration and to refortify your damaged or dry hair.